back to square one. The idiom, back to square one, is used to describe a situation where someone has to start over from the beginning, often because their previous efforts have been unsuccessful or have led to no progress. It implies a sense of frustration or disappointment. The origin of this idiom is uncertain, but one theory suggests that it comes from early radio or television sports commentary. In some sports, like football or soccer, the field is divided into numbered squares for better communication among the commentators. When a player makes a mistake or fails to make progress, they may be sent back to the starting square, which is square one. Here are a few examples to help you understand the usage of this idiom. 1. After spending months researching and writing, my computer crashed and I lost all my work. Now, I have to start my project from square one. 2. Sarah was trying to fix her car's engine, but after several failed attempts, she realized she had to go back to square one and seek professional help. 3. The negotiation between the two companies reached a dead end, and they had to go back to square one to find a mutually agreeable solution. 4. The architect presented their design to the client, but it was rejected. They had to scrap the entire plan and go back to square one. 5. John spent hours studying for his exam, but when he received his results, he failed. Now, he has to go back to square one and retake the exam. In all these examples, the idiom, back to square one, is used to convey the idea of starting over or going back to the initial stage due to a setback or lack of progress. It emphasizes the frustration and disappointment associated with having to redo or restart something.